Hey guys, it's Renee. So for this two pairs of lips earrings, first I'm gonna be making the template. I found, I think it was on Pinterest, like a hack on how you can make um, or how you can draw lips that are even. And first they draw a triangle like this. And then what seems to be like a bird flying for top lips and then the bottom lips, you just go like that. And I'm drawing all this on a piece of paper. Then I'm just gonna be cutting the shape that I like the most. I'm gonna be using this porcelain clay. This kind of clay hardens with air, which means you don't have to bake anything. And I just prefer to work with this one, but feel free to use a polymer clay as well. Then I'm going to be using my roller with my two rings, like those green rings that I have on the edges. Those are there so that I can have like the same thickness all throughout my clay. So I'm just gonna be rolling my clay with my roller and then just going with my template and with my exacto knife i'm just going to be cutting the shape before my clay dries if you're using polymer clay cut them the same way i'm doing right now and then you just bake then i'm going to let them dry i'm going to be painting them these are going to be your breath lips and so i'm using my red acrylic paint my brush and i'm giving this a few coats and then i'm going to be making them into earrings i should have done this before i paint them i wasn't really thinking i'm going to be gluing two ear pasts with my uh, super glue on the back of my stud earrings let them dry then i'm going to be adding a few details on the edges with my gold acrylic paint and i'm using this undetting tool that i do have the diy on it's basically a toothpick holder and i use toothpicks as undetting tools and as brushes a lot of the times i'm going to be painting the back in gold and the edges like this as a final step i'm going to be adding some gloss the one that i'm using is my sculpey and i'm giving this two to three coats now this is it for my dainty earrings for my other like more statement or more dangle earrings i'm going to be doing the same thing as far as the template goes but i'm going to be making my triangle bigger doing the same thing and then just cutting it but before this dries i'm going to be making a tiny hole just so that i can hang them with my dotting tool i do have the diy for this one and then i'm letting this dry if you're using polymer clay this is when you bake them then doing the same thing painting them with first my red going with my gold on the edges with my dotting tool and adding my gloss as well and letting them dry then i'm going to be using a couple of jump rings and ear wires and i'm going to be using my pliers to open my jump rings place both my lips earrings through that hole and then my ear wires then i'm going to closing them and yeah guys these are the two earrings that i want to share with you honestly i like them both they were really easy to make and i like them both for different situations or just occasions the more daintier ones i feel like they are easier to wear and pair off with anything because they are not a statement but the other ones are just so much fun to wear because they are more statement louder they add something really fun to any outfit but yeah i really hope you like them both let me know in the comments what you think of them hopefully you like them too if you did give this video a thumbs up check out more earrings that i have on my channel subscribe for more and share them thank you so much for watching i'll talk to you later and take care bye